us to our colleague Parikshit Lutra, who is in conversation with Deepak Thakur, who is the MD and CEO of Mahindra Sustain, to discuss all about the group's 1200 crore investment in a renewable energy project. Yes, uh, Mahindra Group is investing 1,200 crores in a 150 megawatt hybrid renewable energy project. This is a mix of wind and solar and largely this is going to be for captive capacity of the Mahindra Group, uh, helping the company adopt 100% renewable energy by 2030. Let me go across with Deepak Thakur, MD and CEO of uh, Mahindra Sustain. So Mahindra Sustain, Deepak, will be developing this project. Give us a sense of uh, where is the funding coming from? Is it entirely from the Mahindra Group? And what actually is the 2030 target across Mahindra Group businesses? So let me take the first. Uh, first of all, thank you so much for having me on the, on the program. Um, as far as the Mahindra Group is concerned, uh, we have made a commitment uh, with respect to sustainability goals. And within that, uh, the RE transition uh, commitment that we have made is that we'd like to move to 100% power by 2030. Um, with regard to this particular project, this project that we are setting up in Maharashtra as a group captive project uh, actually is uh, part of the bigger plan that the Mahindra Sustain Group has actually committed to. So we have actually committed to building about five and a half thousand megawatts of projects in the next five years. Uh, and for this, the shareholders, that is the Bindra Group and Ontario Teachers Pension Plan, which has a 39.9% stake within the group, uh, within Sustain, mm. have actually committed equity mm. uh, for this particular build-up. Mm. This 150 is, as I mentioned, is part of this entire uh, five and a half thousand megawatt plan that we have approved uh, at our end. Right. Uh, would Mahindra Group like to expand such hybrid capacity to provide renewable energy to other manufacturers, other companies? Is there a plan on the cards? Uh, so, yes, I think even this uh, group captive project that we have set up, currently I think uh, would about close to about 55-56% of the total capacity is uh, committed by auto and farm sector and other group companies which are based in Maharashtra, which will actually utilize this power. And the balance, 35-40% of the power actually is something that we would look at uh, contracting with third-party entities. Right. Uh, tell us about your key growth drivers for your portfolio in uh, FY25. So, um, if you, I'll just take a step back. So, if you look at uh, sustains growth, we have already done about 1,500 megawatt, 1,540 megawatts of projects, solar projects that we have built as a developer uh, in the last six years. And now we have, a, as I mentioned, a plan to build up about five and a half thousand megawatts, which is almost three and a half times of that capacity in the next uh, five years. Of this capacity, we already have about 2,000 megawatts, including this 150 megawatt project that we just spoke of, uh, of capacity which has already been won or acquired by, by Mindra Sustain. And we are in the process of now constructing and building this capacity. All right, so that's some interesting conversation with Mahindra Sustain. What we'll do is we'll take a short...